Welcome to the Bonita Nature Place. A map! Yes. We're here. Where do you want to go? Alright. Whenever you're observing wildlife, remember certain rules. Number one, don't harass the wildlife. It can be illegal. If you must do so, use children. They can't go to jail. Number two, keep a safe distance. This gopher tortoise has a striking range of 12 feet. Number three, make sure you walk your children in height order. Panthers will always attack the little ones first. Number four, let your children's curiosity run wild. When observing creepy crawlies like this cicada emerging from its shell, remind them cicadas don't have mouth parts. How do they eat? Here at the Benita Nature Place, you can see gopher tortoises, butterflies, minnows, and very big spiders. The Benita Nature Place is perhaps best known for the wide variety of butterflies that can be observed around the property. The beloved monarch, zebra longwing, the cloudless sulfur, or perhaps a less known breed such as the striped hair streak, which is often confused with a Brazilian skipper. The zebra longwing, like these eating on the nectar of the cannabis plant, are Florida's official state butterfly. As nectar and pollen eaters, they're known to live six times longer than most other butterfly species. I may want to consider changing my diet. It's welcoming to be reminded of the creepy crawlies in the woods like bees, snakes, bats, and boars. It's probably a good idea to let your kids go first so they can flush out these creatures. While walking through the woods at the Bonita Nature Place, don't just look for wildlife. Keep a keen eye for certain plant life too. This purple mushroom, while deadly to humans, has psychotropic effects on insects and other creatures of the woods. After a quick snack of that purple mushroom, this grasshopper turned on his friend and started eating him. He then took notice of me. Hey buddy, how you feeling? Something you'll come across off a lot in the woods are spiders. Don't be afraid, this one can't hurt you. But be mindful of the arboreal giant spider, which can grow to 20 feet in length and can rain down on its victims, injecting them with a toxin that makes them appear completely clueless. Best to duck and run. When you're at the Bonita Nature Place, be sure to check out Cullum's Trail, where you may be lucky enough to run to local hydric soils expert, Alex Grant. You may come across all sorts of oddities along Cullum's Trail, like the threesome tree. These three trees are intertwined. You can always go enjoy the tranquility and peacefulness at the kayak launch. Make sure you look around at that tannic water. It's great to see these cichlids enjoying the water around the kayak launch. But there's something far more sinister in these waters. Large schools of mosquito fish inhabit the area right around the kayak launch stairs. If you choose to dip your toe in the water, be mindful. Not only do mosquito fish eat mosquito larvae, they have a taste for human flesh. Of course, wealthy ladies in New York City pay hundreds of dollars to get this sort of treatment. And you can enjoy it right here in Bonita for free at the Bonita Nature Place. Although I have to warn you, it does tickle a bit. 
when exploring at the Bonita Nature Place, being mindful of the different areas, including these cypress knees. Cypress really enjoy staying wet most of the year. But in and around these cypress knees are water snakes, such as the moccasin. If you look closely, you'll see this one scoot to the tree. Did you see it? Whether you're a drop of rain or a turtle or a fish swimming in the water at the Bonita Nature Place, they all rely on a clean environment. So please, do your part.